please welcome to Ken. Hi. Hi everybody, and I'm Charles, and I am the CEO of Tucan. And Tucan is a software company based in Boston, and we are here to uh, help you enhance your product with the best best in class analytics. So what we have seen is that it's very uh, hard to integrate analytical capabilities into your product. Where, uh, and in the other, on the other hand, it is key for your customer to gain new ones to retain these customers. But hiring developer is a very scarcity. It's very hard. It's very hard to hire them. It's very hard to keep them, and they are very expensive. So how you how you can make great things without? Uh, <laughs> very expensive developers. If you want to go for in-house development regarding analytical capabilities, this can lead to very high development costs. This can defocus your engineering team for your core product. This can lead to painful maintenance, and it leads to uncertainty in terms of quality and timing of the deliverables. What we provide is a very easy way, an unbeatable way, to grow your business by providing the most polished product to your customers. We allow non-developers to build data interface. And you will divide your time to market by five and your cost by three. We provide these analytical platforms that you can integrate into your product in just a few clicks. In just a few clicks. We provide the seamless white label integration with access right management. We provide, we provide you with the best UX on the market that's available on the US, and we provide you with the uh, most versatile data connectivity. At the end, you can easily design and embed impactful visualization into your product. We are recognized by peers and analysts, and we have very uh, happy customers that can testify that we truly divide the cost <laughs> and the time to market by a huge factor. Thank you very much. I will show you in just a, a few seconds how we can do that. Okay. 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 Yeah. So see here, I have built a, a visualization. So let's, let's rebuild it together. That's very easy. So let's say I want to create a new story, a new visualization. So I will edit this story. I will add a new chart. I will select some data. So here I already uploaded some data that I loaded into uh, the request domain. So I will use this data. And then I will build my chart. So what I see is that I have a label column. So I will use the, the label column. And I have a value column, you see here. OK. Once I have done that, I will add filters. That's very easy. Uh, uh, filters based on, uh, I think it was period. And another filter based on uh, the breakdown column. So once I have done that, I have uh, managed to build a very simple visualization. I will add some comments for my users. Comment, blah, blah, blah. And once I have done that, I can save it, publish it into production, and then when I'm going to production, what I can do is that I can go and retrieve an embed code that I will be able to very easily copy paste, and then say, okay, I want to add, so this is like a, a Wix, uh, uh, a Wix uh, website, but it can be your product. And let's say, okay, I want to add it here. And when I refresh, I should be able to embed very easily my visualization. So what we do is that we help, sorry, we help non-developers to build this awesome visualization and integrate them into your product in just a few clicks. Thank you, and I'm happy to answer your Q&A. The output format? Is it something that could be used in other types of rendering engines? Or? Yeah, very good question. So when you build into the platform, uh, so it's a pure web-based platform, and then it can be output 
in, uh, in, uh, into a mobile application. It can be output into a PDF file. It can be output into a PowerPoint. It can be output for any, any devices, even for digital TV screens. Yeah. Um, what is the kind of like the secret sauce to this solution? Because there are a couple of other companies like Locker who you could go both like Google and uh, uh, Microsoft as their uh, Power uh, BI. Yeah. Uh, very similar to what you have, but like yeah. maybe different ways. But like, what is your secret source? Yeah, that's very, very good question. I think that at the end, what you see is graphs. Uh, and that's why you say this is the same. But uh, uh, what you have to see is the workflow and the UX to get there. And uh, the, uh, the timing and uh, effort it, it, it requires to build this, vis this visualization and then to integrate them. So the secret sauce that we have put here into the product, it's uh, the UX and uh, very simple usability for this uh, uh, workflow. Yeah? To answer the gentleman's question, it's um, low code, low code template. Yeah. So what's the traction? So we have started the company six years ago uh, in Europe, and we opened the Boston office six months ago. We, uh, do we, we are doing six million revenue. And we are uh, 70 people, and uh, so good traction. And we, we raised our Series A six months ago with the uh, Balderton Capital. Yeah. What uh, what sources do you generally find uh, connecting to? Is this sort of same thing? Open. It depends on the technical stack of the of the customers. Sometimes it just flat files because people haven't built <laughs> that, that architecture. Uh, some customers are very advanced. They have put every uh, all of their data into the cloud, for example, in BigQuery or in the Snowflake. And sometimes it's a mix between APIs, flat files, or SQL database. We are agnostic uh, on your data source. So to be honest, we don't care uh, where the data comes from. So you'll connect to on-prem data sources? It can be also, yes. We are a, a fully Docker solution, meaning that we uh, means that we can be deployed on-prem or on the cloud. Ah, OK. So it's not strictly a SaaS. Yeah, okay. it can be on-prem also. Yeah. Got it. Parquet file? Sorry? Input file Parquet in just Parquet? Ah, Parquet, yes. You, you, can, you can use Parquet files, yes. Yeah. Hadoop Spark, this and that? Yeah, data connectivity is not an issue. It's a commodity, uh, uh, to be honest. So uh, this is not where the, the difficulty is. So come with the data you have, and you'll be able to build uh, great visualizations and embed them to your product very easily. What does the name mean? <laughs> the name is the name of the bird, <laughs> the chicken bird. So it's here because it's an agile solution. It's here to uh, because it's a colorful bird, and we're here to. Uh, Make uh, a data great again. <laughs> <laughs> One more? One more? Thank you very much. Have a nice day.